was originally. Gamba for anymore. Oh god. Then the girls? Sorry guys and girls. So we're back here. It's Easter! Did the Easter Bunny come to your house? Coming! Oh! Black screen! Something epic will happen. Okay, yes, we are near you. And then I brought me a sip of water. What's this? What is this screen? It's a Google thing. I plug it in. Over here. It's coming up. Google. G for Google. We're doing trivia today. Hey Google. Wait, are you feeling lucky? You must indeed, you must indeed say, hey Google. Dang. Yeah, you need to say that to get what you want on here. Hey guys, I would like you to do this How many people well. are playing today? One. One contestant. Let's do this. Okay, your game name is Puddles. You can use your regular name outside of the game. Okay guys, I would like you to play along as well. Well, if you don't want to, we don't have to. Food. Okay, food. Another name for a baker's dozen is the devil's dozen. True or false? True. Okay, we'll see about that. <laughs> Good job. In the United Kingdom, bakers had to sell goods by the dozen at a specific weight or they'd get fined, so some bakers included an extra item to be sure the required weight was met. Please, play along. Let's keep going. But if you're free, you don't need to, but animals. if you want, let's play along. What was the first animal to orbit the Earth? Oh! I would say a monkey. For cow. Monkey. It's definitely a monkey. Great, let me check. Dog, that's okay. What? A stray dog named Laika was sent into orbit on the Soviet spacecraft Sputnik 2. It was a dog? Next question. The category oh is language. What does the Thai phrase, frog underneath the coconut shell, mean? Ignorant fool, timid person, right moment, or sheltered life? Mm. Timid person? Got it. Ignorant fool. Bummer. More than 80 species of frog are native to Thailand. Thailand? Here's the next one. Close to my brother's the name. The category is Thailand. search. Which noodle is most searched for? Soba, pho, ramen, or spaghetti? Mm -hmm. it's <laughs> ramen! Ramen! The category is help. I don't know what just happened, but I'm guessing ramen. Tongue, nerves, heart, or eye. I would say tongue. Hey Google. Tongue. Super. Let's see. Tongue. Yes! Like tongue it couldn't Like it couldn't have been the heart. Like what? Hey guys, and I comment down below if you want more of this. Okay, that like only took us four minutes to do another round. You got two out of five correct. That was terrible. Terrible, terrible. Well, that was fun. Do you want to play again? No. 
Okay. Okay. Hey, go, go. Why are you feeling lucky? I'm getting all the done on purpose, guys. There's a time. Okay, sorry it paused. How about a number between one and six? One. One contestant. Let's do this. My name's Scooter. I like giving people nicknames. Yours is Scooter. Yeah, I've played this before and now every character's nickname. Hey guys, comment down below if you want this. The category um, for more oh. and hey, you want to see me face against an opponent like my brother? My mom, my dad? Wait, repeat! Ancient Romans ate flamingo tongue. True or false? False? True, true, true. True, 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 true. I don't think that's one of. Hey Google, true? I don't think that's one of the options. Try um, something like the first one. Uh, the first one. Great, let me check. <laughs> Spanish, sorry, that's too bad. Spanish is spoken by over 400 million people around the world. <laughs> Only Chinese has more native speakers. Financially false. Next question. The category is science. What insect can age in reverse? Stag beetle, ant, gypsy moth, or honey bee? Gypsy moth. And I regret that. Super. Let's see. I regret that. Honey bee. Bummer. A honey bee? On work that usually goes to younger bees, the molecular structure of their brain changes. Whoa! Backwards. I was gonna get the moth or the beetle. The Yo! A honeybee? Which element is most certain? Hydrogen, oxygen, helium, or carbon? Helium. Great, let's check. Carbon, bummer. Diamonds, one of the world's hardest materials, and graphite, one of the softest. I don't even know what carbon is. The category is sports. Okay. For the basketball, I'm Early good. golf balls were yeah. stuffed with what? Feathers. Oh, I salt, did this. Rubber or graphite. What was it? No. Dang it. <laughs> what me? Okay, it was rubber or feathers. I say I say feathers. Hey Google. What were early golf balls stuffed with? Wood. Here's a summary from Whoa. the website. Yep, Google said feathers. Did I say feathers? So I think of it. I'll get back to uh, the game. Okay, got the game back and some of the Are you feeling lucky? Full disclosure, I don't care if you feel lucky. I'm still going to ask you questions. Okay. How many are playing this time? Two. Two people playing. Awesome. One of you has to step up and be the first player in this group. Say hello, player one. Hello. Now that's how you say something. I have a nickname for you. It's Nibbler. And let's go to player two. Please say hi there. Hi there. Game. Okay. Pause the video, and my dad's name is Poe I'm pretty sure, and my name's Nibble. For 10 points, Athen pinchers were originally bred in medieval Europe to catch witches. True or false? You go first, Nibbler. False. Curious answer, thanks. How about you, Poe Down? False. Okay, thanks. False. Yay. Great. 
They were bred to look good. Next question. The category is Google search. One momento. For housewives, 19 hey, Google. kids and counting. Repeat. Which reality show was more searched in the U.S. in 2016? The Real Housewives, 19 Kids and Counting, The Bachelorette, or Teen Mom? Teen Mom. Yeah, definitely. Really? All right. There's some 19 Kids and Counting. 19 Kids and Counting. Oh, hold on. The Bachelorette. I'm sad oh, really? for you. Oh. Five couples from The Bachelorette are still together, while only two from its sibling show, The Bachelor, have made it. Huh. On to the next one. The category is language. You know, I was cut that way. <laughs> yeah. For 15 points. Which of these English words comes from Swedish? Boat, blister, rutabaga, or mountain? Let's start with nibbler. <laughs> Rutabaga. That is Fantastic. definitely it. And now you go, hold down. Lister. Wait, no, I think I'm Super. making no Let's kid. see. <laughs> Rutabaga. Yes! Rutabaga, yeah. a cross between a turnip and a cabbage, appears to have originated in Sweden. Let's move on. The category is health. For 15 points. Onerophobia has a fear of what? Commitment, dreams, video games, or socks? Please go first, hoe down. Commitment. Okay, I'll accept that. And now you go, Nibbler. Dreams? Oh, thanks. Hold on. Dreams. Great. That's like the only obvious explanation, because like, the fear of something, like, it would have to be dreams, because like, your dream could come true if it's like, a scary dream, like, it could come true, like, it, 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 it's obvious that. Yeah, smart kid. The more points you'll get. For 30 points. What year was April 1st first associated with pranks? You go first, Nibbler. 1990. Oh, sorry. Thanks for that. Oh. Your turn. Oops. Let's okay, so I need a good Dr. Shapin. Eighteen ninety nine. Got it. Thirteen ninety two. Yo! From Jeffrey Chaucer's The Canterbury Tale. Let's hand out some points. Oh, well, looks like you won your smart. Go down. You get an impressive thirty points. Nibbler. Okay, One sec. In second place, it's hold down. And in first place, rating the life of transcendent knowledge is... Nibbler. 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 Good job, Nibbler. Please take your place at the side of the great battle. Ooh, what do I get? And accept your imaginary prize. Yeah. You got the lantern of Captain Seven. It looks rusty! And sometimes it shuts off halfway down the creepy trail to the campsite. Just give it a shake. Maybe whack it a few times. Well, that was fun. Do you want to play again? No. Okay, guys. So, that is all you can do. Comment. Okay. 64 likes. 64. 64 likes to do more of that. And if we make it over 100, I'll do it with. No, if we make it over 80, I'll do it with um, multiple people, with like my family. I did it with my dad half of the video. So, 
guys. Happy Easter. Did you, did the Easter Bunny come to you? The egg. The egg. Watch yesterday's video. It's Easter Eve. See y'all. Good then, Dad.